What's up guys, Sid here. Uh, I got some yard sale and thrift store pickups to show you guys uh, that I've picked up um, last couple days, Friday and Saturday. Uh, so we shall get right into it. Uh, pick this up here. Actually, I'll show you this one first. I need a new tape player because my Crossley, was it a 4-in-1, 5-in-1? That's it right up there tape player went uh, bust on that so I needed a tape player I'm probably going to end up getting another Crossley but I just wanted something for now so I picked this up uh, it has not been tested I paid five bucks for it untested uh, it's a dual tape deck here um, thought I could find some speakers for it today at the same time I bought it but I wasn't able to so uh, the main place I thought I would be able to find speakers I saw this uh, this is a General Electric Space Maker AM FM radio and cassette player uh, I did test it out. Everything works on it. it sounds pretty good too. Uh, they wanted eight bucks for it, but I was able to talk them down to five. So I got that for five bucks. Uh, picked this up for a quarter. I, I believe this is a kind of a rare item. This is uh, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Storm Drain Savers. A little special giveaway back in 1990, um, created in co cooperation with the United States Environmental Protection Agency Water Division. Um, it's all about uh, water and conserving water and things like that describe storm drains and things all with the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles obviously it's uh, something that you could color and everything but it's uncolored and good condition and everything so I think that might be a really good find uh, at the same thrift store that I got that uh, I got a pair of swim trunks needed those my wife uh, bought an 18 foot pool Got the Aliens novelization. I used to have this. Super excited to get that back. I'm thinking that was a quarter. Uh, I got this. This is Demon City Shinjuku on VHS. This is 1994. Uh, 82 minutes. Unrated. Suitable for most audiences. Parental discretion advised. So I got that for, I think, 50 cents. This is really cool. I paid a quarter of 50 cents for this. This is Lost, Lonely, and Vicious. Postcards from the great trash films. Uh, it is missing a few of them, but there are some is still in here. These are large postcards. See, there's the other side right there. These are awesome. Blonde bait. That is sweet. Alimony. Captive women. Girls on the loose. One girl's confession. These are just amazing. Teenage dolls. Uh, came out in 1988. It's a first edition. Wish all the postcards were in there, but still, it's definitely worth, like I said, I think it was a quarter or 50 cents. Uh, I got a couple of signed CDs. I finally found a signed Les Gilliam CD. Uh, unfortunately, it's only his first name there, but uh, made out to Tom and Marie, or Mary. Uh, thanks for your hospitality and friendship. Les 812 2000, it looks like. Uh, he is very, very famous here in Oklahoma. Um, Will Rogers was his name. It was a really good song of his. Uh, but I have seen his CDs and records and stuff everywhere, but I've just never found anything signed until today, so really happy to find that. He's not just famous in Oklahoma, but um, he's really well known here. And I also found a signed uh, David Phelps CD. Um, pretty famous Christian country singer, Southern Gospel. Uh, he was on Extreme Makeover Home Edition, I believe it was. So those are a buck a piece on those CDs. Awesome scores. Uh, another thrift stop I went to today. Everything was 30% off that you're going to see in this particular bag. This is the Pirates of the Caribbean plug and play games. I've been finding a lot of plug and play games lately. Uh, it's from Jack Specific. I have not tested that, so hopefully that works. So that was under two dollars with 30 percent off uh, I got Condor Man from Walt Disney Films starring Michael Crawford and Oliver Reed uh, it was a dollar so it was 30 percent off of that uh, it's a book for my wife and this is kind of interesting I thought this is how to try a spirit it's how to vanquish it's, uh, from 1976 how to vanquish all different types of spirits how to recognize and vanquish all different types of spirits so I just thought that was kind of a there you go, spirit of whoredoms 
I just thought that was really cool. And it was 30% off of half off because when the red line's marked through it, it's half off. So that was pretty cool. Oh, and these were actually free. They have a bucket of free toys out, and these were free. These are the McDonald's Mickey and Friends Epcot Center Adventure at Walt Disney World. This is Mini in Japan. There's the other side. And this is Chip in China. There's Chip and Dale Chip right there. Still see the little toys. These are from 1990. No, I'm sorry, 1993. Both from 1993. So for free, I'm definitely going to grab those up. And last but not least, this is the stuff I got yesterday. Friday, I got these three. Uh, this is all from the same yard sale. I got these three original NES games. Super Mario and Duck Hunt for 50 cents. Star Tropics for 50 cents. And Super Mario Brothers 3 for 50 cents. It does have the crack there, but I've tested these and they all work great, so they are all for sale. Got uh, the Johnny Depp Alice in Wonderland Blu ray, DVD, and digital copy. Three disc combo pack for two bucks. Awesome deal. That movie is great. Got a PS3 game. This is Little Big Planet Greatest Hits. Only $1. And then the find of the day was. This Nintendo 64, this is the second one I've found in a week. She wanted 10 bucks. I, I asked if she'd take five, and she did. Comes with two games, Pokemon Stadium and Star Wars Shadows of the Empire. And it also has, as the color controller here, and it also has the, if I can get this open, I just found out about this recently because I just sold the other N64 I had. It has this uh, the rarer expansion jumper pack thing. Um, if it says jumper pack and has all the information written on it that you can read, it's not worth as much. But these apparently go for about 20 bucks a piece. Just that. Now I had no power cord or anything, but I did have power cords and I was able to test it and it does work. Uh, the games work fine. Uh, already sold this online for. For 30 bucks shipped um, just because I know I pay five bucks for it so in order to move it quickly I only sold it for 30 so I still made a profit so I'm happy with that so that's everything guys that's my haul um, hope you enjoyed and uh, we'll talk to you later see you